Okay, we're coming back online. Hello, everyone. Uh, welcome back uh, to the Subpixel stream. Special shout out to my mom, Colton Rabel. Love you. <laughs> Love you, mom. Let's uh, let's see how this looks latency wise. Three seconds. That's not bad. Okay, so I'll just make sure to do this slow. Are you ready, Will? Okay. Yes, I am ready. So first, I want to go to the festival because I want to show you my beautiful baby boy. I'm just driving until I find the train. Okay, so here's my baby boy. Um, do you like his outfit? Oh, he's adorable. I, know, I love the right? pants. Or the shorts. Look at those shoes. I know. I know. Is he like I, I am have into this. I have keep calm and kick clutch. <laughs> wow, that's just obnoxious. See, it's just oh, annoying. Like me I, off I, the bridge. I don't even I, like I can't even buy these things. They're just all locked behind like levels and Ugh. Gold shirt. Okay. Let's see. Jackets. Got this sweet leather jacket. Ooh. Okay. I'm just kinda going through here, seeing what some of this uh Santa's running shorts. I can't I can't wear anything else. Well maybe I can wear these guys. What do you think about these guys? Uh ooh, those aren't bad. Right? Those aren't bad. Oh my gosh, my car almost did a front flip. Okay, By I'm front wear... flip, I mean back flip. I'm gonna wear those for a little bit. And then um I was thinking about going with these. These boots for my uh for my footwear. Yes, the yellow wellies, I'm into it. Yes, 100%. or this is, uh, this is kind of the extreme version of the wellies, these biker boots. No, wellies are so much better. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was thinking. Okay, hats, um, I just got I Lame. just got this classic bowler hat. You like it? Uh, yeah, you know what? I, I was thinking it was still on Fedora, so I was confused. But yeah. yes, I like the bowler hat. Okay, let me go to the bowler. Okay, I only have these glasses, which are just clear aviator glasses. Yeah, that's all I have as well. Don't have any of these noses. I don't have any wrists. I've just got biker gloves, but those don't... Ooh, actually, that looks pretty good. What do you think? Ooh, you look hardcore. I know, right? I don't have any of these outfits. These chicken outfits. I know, I would like a chicken outfit. These are weird. Oh, but this is the best part. So some of these... Um, I'm gonna show you my favorite. Oh, here's here's this one. You gotta have the dab. Okay. Ugh, so I know, bad. Right. What's that from? The dab? I don't even know, man. So let me show you my favorite. Okay, it's down here. It's called Thumbs Up. Here it is. Oh, that's the worst thing ever. <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then there was there was another. The wind funny up is one. the worst thing. Oh, then there's this one. Uh, Colton says you need a fancy twirly mustache. All they have uh, are those stupid like clip on mustaches. I know, and it makes me angry. And it doesn't tell you how to unlock them. Oh, oh, that's a wall you cannot go through. Okay, I'm feeling pretty good about that. Okay, so now let me show you um, some of my cars. Uh. This is view car. Here we go. This is my Kirby car. Ooh, that's adorable. I know, right? Look at it. Oh, that makes me want to go play Kirby. Okay, so now let me uh, let me show you some others. Let's see what else I got that's interesting. I already showed you the Kinder car. Uh, here's your Ford Focus. Man, you have a lot of cars. I think like almost all of them are from uh, from the wheel spins. How, how often do you get those? It's I think you get a wheel spin every level, and you get a level every time your influence comes up. And gotcha. then I think you get 
you can get wheel spins from your car perks as well. But then I think you can also get wheel spins from, you know how like you're leveling up your dirt racing series, etc. So some of those level ups have spins or super wheel spins in them. So it definitely throws a lot of stuff at you a lot more frequently than before. Interesting. Ooh, I like this one. Okay, so this is... This is a uh, cigarette-themed Land Rover. Because somebody oh decided gosh. that they wanted a camel cigarette slivery. <laughs> um, uh, I don't know if I have told you this before, but that is my ultimate car that I want, is a Land Rover Defender. Oh, they're so good. They're so good. I love them. Okay, let's I have see. always wanted one. Um, this is my Vagisil car. Yep. Wait for it. It's purdy. I'm into it. It's real purdy. Medicated purdy. cream. So my car looks very similar to this, but it's red. And it doesn't have the hard top. Okay. Let's see... I got the dominoes. I already showed that one. Um, Colton is asking, how customizable are the cars in this game? Uh, Very the... customizable. So let's actually, let's pick a car and customize it. Which car should I pick? Oh, he says dabbing comes from a football player. It gained popularity from a football player. Ew. Interesting. Okay, which car am I customizing? What are we thinking? Oh, you know what? Um, let's... Ooh, ooh, what was that? Vulcan Forza Edition. This? Yeah. Okay. Or that DBGT Gato Zagato. Let's customize this guy. Okay, so I'm going to go to Designs and Paints. So first, uh, I'll show the design customization. So we can do... We can create our own, like, vinyls. So we can paint the car, and you can paint individual pieces. Actually, yeah, let's do that real quick. Let's just make this guy ugly. I'm going to make the hood hot pink. <laughs> yes, and the mirrors are going to be uh, camo. Desert camo. Oh, it doesn't really work. What are we thinking? It doesn't look as good as I want it to. But like a rose gold. Well, I'll make them out of wood. So they look like walnuts. Actually, they look like almonds. Do you see that? <laughs> they do look like <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so now the uh, the spoiler. It's our nut car. Oh, wait. This isn't actually changing any color, is it? I regret saying that now, but I'm going to stand by it. Okay. Change the rims to... Ooh, that's cool. This Prisma color. Make one small piece just a bright matte yellow. Okay. Oh, I can kind of make the I can, I can make the windows yellow. I think there's actually only the hood, the rest of the car. Actually, I'm not even sure. Here, I'll make the I'll make the windows yellow. And then the body Oh, that's the whole body. Oh, you can't even change most of the colors on this car. Oh, I picked a bad one. Anyways, yeah, so you can do that, and then I'll show you the liveries. Which are basically, you can design your own livery by putting, like, shapes on it, on stuff. But it's, so the... um... It's not... Ooh, it's very hard to get customized. Um, so the livery is different than just painting it? Yeah, the livery, think of it as like a, a design. Okay. So I'll show you. So you can do like create your own Does vinyl. the livery override all colors? Yes. Okay. Think of that the livery was... as like a pre-designed okay. paint job That's basically car. what I was, I was yeah. getting at. And you could, you can design your own by going through like all of these shapes and stuff. Gotcha. But there's so many of them; it's ridiculous, really. And then you have to like individually place them. 
So it's, I don't know how people design liveries well. So what I do is I just go to new designs for the car, which shows all these like top rated liveries. So you can see we can do all these. Oh, I found the one. Here's the one I need. This guy right here. So you can see yes. that somebody has already made this design for their car and they've uploaded it. And they get credits or influence every time you download their design. But now I have... Oops, I didn't need to exit completely, but it'll work anyways. So now I have this custom livery for the car. Nice. I'm into that. Yeah. Okay, so now let me show you. So this, this car is stock... So it, it kind of drives. It's got like a little bit of muscle power behind it, but not a lot. It's hard to handle. But I can also completely customize the mechanics of it. Yeah, yeah, Colton. It's it's almost the same as the um, the Black Ops 2 Emblem Maker. And I think Grand Theft Auto Online for GTA 5 had something similar as well, where you would make you would use the emblem and the different shapes yes. to make your your like clan. Not super customizable, as I recall. Yes. Um, so, but you can also upgrade your mechanics or tune them. So tuning is... Tuning is just changing things like your tire pressure, your gearing, your alignment. So you can actually get very mechanically in-depth, and it does make a difference. Like I haven't done that in this game, but one of the things I did in Forza Horizon 3, which is nearly similar, is I had upgraded a car but it felt like the rear end was sliding too much, so I changed the uh, alignment a little bit so that essentially I had a different camber in the rear, etc., so that it, it handled a little bit better, and it was actually a noticeable difference in the car. Without That's actually, awesome. Yeah, without having to change parts, I was just changing how they were set up, which is pretty cool because it's still an arcade racer, but it's still just simulation and technical and realistic enough that you can get into those realistic details if you want to. Yeah. Um, and then speaking of upgrades, you can also do like mechanical upgrades. So I can take this car, I can say, Hey, it's a little bit slow. So let me, um, you know, change the camshaft. I'll put it up to a, a racing camshaft, which is going to increase the speed and the horsepower, put a nicer flywheel. So it spins up better because who needs torque? Actually, that's not making a huge difference. Um, I can do my exhaust, and I can put a spoiler on the back, right? I can do that, right? It, it does kind of, so you notice in this one I just have the stock spoiler, and then the Forza spoiler, which is just this little tiny flap here. Mm -hmm. it, it doesn't let you put any spoiler on the car, which kind of stinks. Like, let's say there's 20 different spoiler types in the game, it heavily restricts which type of spoiler can go on which car, which stinks. You know, maybe I want to put a big honking Mercedes-style wing on the back of it, but it won't let me. Yeah. Um, Got to do a nice... Oh, yeah, look at that. That hood looks good. That's the one I want. That's good in the hood? Good in the hood. So, and then you can do, like, major customization, so I can, like do an engine swap into a V12, which will actually just make the car a lot heavier, but not necessarily faster. Actually, it adds 290 horsepower, but... <laughs> change it to an oh, all-wheel yep. drive. And all of these, like, drastically change. So I'll put a... All of these drastically change the car performance and handling. And then... Um, they also change what class it's in. So it, it can be fun customizing the cars, but it also feels a little limiting in some ways. There are some people who play this just to create drag cars, you know, where you're trying to go a quarter mile as fast as possible. So you're tuning the gearing, things like that. Yeah. Um, Ian, I don't mean to excite you, but we do have four people watching now. <gasps> Is one of them my girlfriend? Probably. Hey, well, mom and dad are out of town. You, I can be your girlfriend tonight. <laughs> <laughs> what does that even mean? Ian, can you come see my super awesome car I just got? Oh, yeah, yeah. Are you near me? 
Can I? I'm at the festival. Okay. Wait, are you outside? Oh, you're right next to me. Oh. <laughs> oh, Minecraft Ferrari. <laughs> it's so good. All right. I think there's only way to end this, which is... Uh, actually, you want to do a drag race? Oh, let's do it. Okay. Where's... Um. Okay, here it is. So follow me and we'll do a drag race. I think oh, yeah. Should... Mario Kart's tough to uh, choose parts. So I play Baby Mario... And I do extremely high acceleration, uh, and I win. Oh, I'm fairly good at Mario Kart. Ow. Ow. Okay, so let's let's get in here. Which way are we facing? Oh, oh, there's an actual drag race. Yeah, I don't feel like launching the event. Okay, but wait, I'm gonna switch cars. So here's the rule: you have to get in your funniest, fastest car, which is probably the one you're in, right? Yeah, That's there was uh, there was a livery that just said that had the Supreme logo all over it. Oh god! And I thought that'd be kind of funny, like being like, "Hey, look, I'm one of the kids." Okay, all right, I'm gonna line up. Oh, I think we I just hold A. I think we just count it. Oh, wait, oh this these, is a good decision. These lights actually work. Wait, can you back up? I want to see if the lights. <gasps> they do. Okay, so let's go up to it, and we'll just go off the lights. Oh, they are. When when do I go when it turns green? I think it's when it turns green. This wow, is these are gonna cool. take a while. Okay, come on. I wonder. I wonder if they're just actually on a loop. No! How? <laughs> <laughs> Bye-bye! You launch! Oh, wow. Oh, man. Oh! <laughs> oh, well, Will, I think this is probably a fitting end to our first live stream. You know what? I'm going to call this a success. I got my girlfriend I, to watch. I, I got my mom to watch. I got my girlfriend to watch, and I got your mom to watch. Look at the, the world's tiniest, cutest donut. This is so fast. I hate you. Okay. Well, if you guys like our content, you can definitely find our channel. It should be right underneath this video. Uh, thanks for watching. We're definitely going to do more live streams in the future. What do you think, Will? Is that a good idea or a bad idea? I think it's a fantastic idea. Yep, and you know what? Since this went so successful, we'll probably advertise the next live streams a little bit in advance just so we can give time people to watch. We honestly weren't sure how big of a mess or slash disaster this first live stream was going to be, but it turned out pretty good. So, yeah, it's not bad. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you later. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.